Hey, what's going on? This is Alden from MontySanders.net. Don't study something and not apply it. This is something I used to do like real, real badly when I got in the home-based business profession in my first company. When I used to just go to these these different events, uh, Super Saturdays, uh, uh, yearly conferences, uh, you know, weekly uh, uh, events too, and not really apply anything. I wonder why I was still staying stacked in my business. <laughs> you know, just get upset of uh, the different uh, things around me, but not really just looking at a man in the mirror as far as realizing, hmm, what am I not doing? What's it apply to anything? I was listening to the, the conference calls. Uh, I was again going to these events, taking all these notes, and not applying anything. It, you know, it's sad because I, I know I'm not the only one, and it, it, you know, a lot of people uh, do this as well. Not so much. And business, but also this everyday life. You know, you might read something, especially in today's days of social media. You might read something, get pumped up. Uh, you might hear something or watch a video, and then you don't go. You don't go and apply it. Don't do that. You know, don't do that to yourself. You're really holding yourself back. And again, I'm speaking from experience because I did this, and it hindered me big time. Uh, really, the last few years is not so much that. I've been just studying. I have been doing my best, you know, slowly but surely applying some stuff. Uh, I noticed this really just my my uh, this everyday walk of life. Uh, just choosing to this, uh, not again, just not just reading books of success. People that are more successful than me, listen to them as well. As far as listening to the language patterns, going to different conferences, but just actually going and applying them. One thing I've really learned, especially again, the online world, the home-based business, uh, the last few years is every event that I've gone to would it be just via just watching through a live stream or being live, uh, I choose to just always go into that event just willing to learn two new things. And I always come up with a lot more information. That's always good. That's just always my my intention going into those events. So that, that's something to just keep in mind with as well when you do uh, go into maybe go into just go maybe listen to something, going to go read something, go to a conference or whatever. Just set up your mind. Uh, what your clear intention is and that's really always my intention as far as going to live events from here on out as far as always just choosing to learn these two new things and again it always comes out to be so much more and it just comes down to just being real clear uh, Napoleon Hill might have mentioned several times as far as having a definite major purpose but it's also being clear as far as what you want and it also comes down to as having a clear intention on something I was not clear years ago when I first got into the home based business profession. That's the reason why I was always hindered as far as uh, trying to go in about you know trying to you know learn something, and apply it because I was not doing so. I was just always just going about again, just taking all these great notes and just not doing anything with it. And again, it hindered me and it summed me up. So something to keep in mind with as far as if you're going to go and study it, just go and apply it because uh, besides feeling a lot better too, maybe if you do. Uh, own something, uh, you will benefit uh, either way. So if you got value for what we shared here, I'd love to read your comments below or like and share this video. And with that being said, I will see you in the next video.